All right, it's now time for interactive. Remember, you can download the Sportsmax app from the Google Play or the App Store and watch a variety of live sporting action. And for viewers in Jamaica, here's a chance to win a trip for two to the Champions League final, courtesy of Joss Bet and Sportsmax. Make a bet of 1,500 Jamaican dollars or more on any game from March 1 to April 28, and you could be one of our lucky winners. And as usual, you can send us your voice notes via WhatsApp and check out our clips on X, Instagram and YouTube. So, Leon Bailey has been left out of Jamaica's squad for the Nations League finals for disciplinary reasons. Let's get some reactions after the 23-man squad was announced earlier on Thursday. Okay, so we have this one from Tyler. He says, no, Leon Bailey, you man don't want to win anything. Tuchel says, Damari Gray makes the squad, but no Leon Bailey. Jay says, not calling up your best player, jokes. At least he won't get injured. Eric, Hedgie, no Leon Bailey, no Pinnock, no Amari Bell. What is this squad? CD says, confusion, full stop. Mashiro, no Pinnock or Bell and Omari ain't called up. This coach already conceded the final. Ryan says, no Bailey, are you joking? All right, so the coach has given the explanation mm -hmm. as to why um, Leon Bailey has been excluded, of course, because of disciplinary reasons. Apparently, there's this rule I think it's the only rule, according to coach, that you're not supposed to leave the hotel after a particular time. And I think um, that's what happened. And Leon Bailey and another player. Trevante Stewart. Yeah, has yeah. been. Well, I just wonder if some of the reactions that we got, they were ignorant to the reasons no, why. No, most what... time people don't listen to the press conference. Yeah, because um, the coach explained himself and he said the players apologized and accepted responsibility for their actions. So. Um, he's trying to set some standards that you know he wants the team to follow, re-guidelines and discipline. So um, I'm not too sure I agree with a lot of the reactions that we got there. But I also will lean to the fact that they have not heard the press conferences and mm -hmm. maybe um, a couple news outlets yeah. can keep pushing the explanation yeah. and not just that he's left And a up. couple of uh, Amari Bell and Ethan Pinnock, they're injured as well. So a couple of queries from those um, ex um, uh, posts. Um, there were some injury issues as well, so some of the players that they were questioning their absence, oh, the coach explained, Hal Grimson ex explained that they were injured, so um, I think the coach explained himself. So. But that's one of the things he said in his interview with me, that whenever he makes decision, he wants to give the public the reason behind yes. it, yes. so that it it clears up the confusion because one of the things that we always talk about is miscommunication leading to confusion and yeah. he said that's something he wanted to one, work on. One of the expos sports just said confusion, full stop. <laughs> and that's exactly what well, the coach is, is to... trying to avoid, so I'm not sure. But you can't please any, everyone, so I, I'm, I'm not surprised about some of the reactions. Just because listen. Leon, Leon Bailey is a star player and people want to see him play and they think that the Jamaica team is is stronger without him and their next assignment is against the USA which is the best team in CONCACAF so I think the fan the fan reaction is 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 really illustrating that people would like to see the best Jamaica team out there playing and um, without Leon Bailey the team isn't as strong yeah so you know that's I, I think it's a disappointment of that yeah for sure on that note we wish you goodbye have a beautiful evening and it's Friday tomorrow we'll see you tomorrow so much joy and rain.